humans? I am the master of snake style and wrestle factory trainer Ophidian and I'm here to bring you episode 15 of Ring Shape. I've decided for episode 15 that we'd take you inside of one of our classes, specifically the tiered classes. I get asked often what the difference between tiered and core is, and I've decided to show you within the Ring Shape series what a tiered class looks like. So, enjoy. In this class, you're gonna learn five bumps, the five fundamental bumps. Most wrestling schools just have one course. Um, you just go, you sign up, and you just join them, and you, you, you do whatever they do. For us, we offer something like that called a core curriculum, and we also have 101 curriculum, and uh, 201 curriculum, and 301 curriculum. That's a tiered class system. No other school in professional wrestling has anything like that. I want you to lift them up into the air and see if you can straighten out your legs without ever losing the flyer. So the base has got to be the arbiter of the balance point there. You get up there and get comfy. You, you learn how to, how to handle your body better. And, and I, th I think that's just one of the coolest aspects is like just the feeling of, of, of like a mind-body connection and improvement is, is really cool. Professional wrestling training is difficult. But under the tiered system, we ease you into it. I never really had tried anything more than a somersault on the ground and getting to jump over a person and flip is an awesome experience. And I think, honestly, a lot of the stuff we've done in this class has worked out muscles that I don't think I've ever used before. Like seeing the progression from week one to week seven and seeing people who, seeing somebody try a resorte and fall directly onto the person they were resorting off of and not just either not being able to get over or not being able to land or like twisting in midair for whatever reason in like week two or three. And then in week seven, getting it. That's like, that's the coolest thing. And then as you start to watch matches, you see somebody perform a German suplex, you say, oh, there's a bridge, there's a back bridge. Or somebody will do a backslide and you see them post up on their backs of their feet, say, oh, that's front bridge. After doing it and uh, having that connection with the rest of my classmates and everybody really just kind of being there for each other and helping each other out, I really feel like things are a little more possible than I expected when I started. So there you have it. You got to hear from some of our tiered students as well as some footage of those guys training. If you'd like more information on this facility or maybe the opportunity to take one of those classes, check out thewrestlefactory.com. Thank you again for joining me and be on the lookout for more ring shape videos. Yes.